This time of year, you'll hear a lot of Canadians complaining about, or at least talking about the cold. Although our body temperatures are more or less identical within a degree or two, it seems that some people may feel the cold more than others. Is that possible? What does the science say? Given how cold your skin is, different people, you know, will perceive that differently. You know, tough people will say, ah, it's not that cold. And, and others will say it is cold. But then the other thing is, is physiological. Different people can actually have different skin temperatures at, in the same uh, weather conditions. Vasoconstriction. The Cleveland Clinic gives this definition. When you're outside in the cold, peripheral vasoconstriction helps your body keep from losing too much heat by making less blood flow to your skin. Older people have less of an ability to respond to the cold in this way and protect themselves from hypothermia. The whole point is to keep your core temperature warm by making your extremities, like fingers and toes, cold. If, if you, uh, someone who is, is really acclimatized to the cold, they will not vasoconstrict as much, so their skin will actually be warmer, and so they won't feel they won't feel as as cold as the person next to them. For most of us, we can acclimatize to the cold over the winter, as we adapt by simply spending time outdoors on a daily basis over time. Some Indigenous Canadians have this response already built in. For the Inuit living in the Arctic, they don't experience vasoconstriction nearly to the degree that those living south of the 60th parallel would. The, the actual receptors and mechanisms that cause vasoconstriction, they have less of those than we do. They're built to, to be vasodilated and keep their fingers warm. Dr. Giesbrecht says that as Canadians, we should worry about frostbite, but be less concerned about hypothermia. And if you are spending time in the cold, make sure you recognize the warning signs that it may be getting dangerous. If you're numb, you have to do something right now. And that's either increase your exercise, uh, maybe heat yourself up from the inside, put on more insulation, or go inside.